Hello everybody, I'm the Modern Shoe, and welcome to another Let's Play episode of FTL Advanced Edition. Today, I'm going to be playing as the Lanius ship. Plain Lanius ship, A. Eh? Only played it once before, right at the beginning, so... Uh, now I have my new acquired Advanced Edition and all, so let's see if we can get a win. Almost got a win, I believe I went to the flagship in the first round. Uh, let's see. I'm going to go ahead and name it... A big bug. Uncapitalized, because that's how we do. Uh, let's see. Kapalka. No. Cap. Ooh. No. Cap. Then we got Nick. Cool. And Maria. Okay, so everything looks good. Let's get started. Starting in Nebula. So, getting goals for this ship. I don't know. It's been actually a pretty long time since I uh, used to ship with a cloning bay. Well, a little bit. Maybe not that long. But, let's see. Beginning objectives. I don't know. We have pretty good uh, anti-ship capabilities. So probably just get some engines. Eventually get more weapons, but that's not top priority because we can get through uh, two shields and do damage. So let's manually share its wreckage. And wow, we got a Hull laser. Sweet. And some stuff as well. So, we got our weapons. <laughs> Let's go ahead and move on. Thon, do we want you guys to be here? Yeah, I'm fine with that. Let's explore the rest of this nebula. Thank god, intruders. That's fine. We'll put the human on doors and then we'll have the Lanius deal with that. Yeah, so... Basically just want to get engines up, get our defense up. You know, this this has a really good start for it just this is a good ship. Good starting. Shit. Send it run back. No, I didn't mean that. Nick, you go. There you go. I think that's how it goes. Yeah, Lanny Say has a really good start. I'm just uh bit scared of the cloning bay. I I really haven't gotten uh, gotten acquainted with it yet. I mean, I'm acquainted. It's just I haven't. I don't really like it still. Let's see. Simple ship. Heavy laser, I believe, fires first, so we should be a, a okay in terms of firing stuff. This uh, this actually. Sultan shield is gonna be a bit of a problem, so they might do damage to us. Ooh, close, close, close. Let's go ahead and air that out. And let's take auto fire off as. Ooh, we dodged that. Nice. Oh, we want to go for weapons now. Oh, they got the heavy laser up. We got our oxygen. It's a bit. Bit less unfortunate. Let's go ahead and put auto fire on now. And we should kill them in three, two, one. Let's get these guys to fix the oxygen. Oh, wait, yeah. I'm all well set up, didn't I? If Nick and Maria suck on the suck on the oxygen room, because that's how you fix stuff in Lanius World. I'm not sure if I should leave all the doors open. I'm curious. Curious, curious. Uh, maybe. I'm not sure. Let's just move on. Be cool if I could get a teleporter. And there's a store. Uh, maybe go to the store. Jump up here, then go to the store. Just see what it has. Uh, maybe we can get a cool uh, teleporting system going on. Get teleporters, get mind control. Let's go looking for the rebel ship, and they doubled it. So maybe we won't be able to make all these jumps. And they have hacking. That's less than, less than ideal. Let's see. Do I need to hack? Uh, let's see. Let's see if they hack weapons. They don't. They hack engines, which isn't that detrimental to us. Ooh, we dodged that nice, so we missed some of that initial 
damage. Let's go ahead and ion stun their shields. And then we'll chain laser their weapons. Very good, very good. Yeah, this is a relatively easy ship. At least for the beginning. I don't think we should have that much trouble like getting into the mid game. We can get through two shields and do damage, which is always something I want to look for. And, uh. Just we have a, a good start. Okay, looks like they're trying to get away. Which would, I think, double the <laughs> pursuit, pursuit again, which would be kind of awful, when I think of it. I mean, they, it looks like they have, like, a system repair drone, because they're repairing stuff really quickly. Oh, we got it. Yeah, it'd be fun to have some, uh, teleports. Emergency respirators. Wow. Really? What? Oh, well, that's a bug. Maybe. The ship already starts with emergency respirators, so it's like, maybe they stack, which I think makes sense. I don't think that's unreasonable. Oh, man, I wanted that. <laughs> That would have been really cool we can have like basically Elanius right there. But oh well. Or at least give it to us so we can sell it. Interesting. Let's continue. Drone control. Mm. Mind control. Mm. Zoltan. Mm. People. Mm. Automated reloader. That is uh that is very tempting. That's also tempting. These are these are some good stuff for the first store. Uh, maybe we just fix up first, though. And this comes with a combat drone. You know, I haven't... The automated reloader is really tempting. I haven't really used mind control to like that great of an ability, so I kind of want to get it. Although the drone control coming with uh, combat drone is pretty tempting. But then again, we have some pretty good uh, weapons anyways to get through shields. Good stuff. I want the auto automated reloader. Even the hacking stun I would have wanted too. But I don't think this is the highest priority. Like this would be really cool with our teleporting setup though. You hack you s hack a room, stun the people in the room, and then you send your dudes over. I wish I could have sold my emergency respirators. Oh my god, first store. This shouldn't be this difficult. Yeah, why don't we get mind control? Because the drone control, although it's good, it's I want to save some drone parts for hacking, especially this early. Let's move on. Now we need some power, and I want to really upgrade engines and weapons so we can get the hull laser up too. Let's hail them. Yeah, I'll definitely take that. It's a good, good cheap fuel. Let's attack the slaver scum, and oh, I need, I need to upgrade surveillance. Oh, they have a shield thing too. That's not that big of a deal. They only have a basic laser. Are they gonna send like a boarding drone? Oh, this poor ship has nothing going for it. <laughs> I'll put, you under, I'll put you on doors then. I mean, surveillance, rather. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's... What is the hockey for this? B? My control. CY Yang. No one's even going to try to defend it. That's good to me. And let's chain laser their... 
Should have waited for the green shield to come up. Oh, nice. He got it down as well. I have to wait for the chain laser to come up because this uh, green shield is killer. Wait, I don't need to go for weapons. What am I thinking? And we can just stun, auto stun the drone. And this is just simple now. Yeah, that's cool how the first level of my. Oh, that's a pretty good evade. The first level of mind control guarantees a uh, system to go down, and I will take Zin Zin because I want to get a boarding crew going. Alright, so let's send everyone back. Zin Zin, you will. You'll just. Man, it's surveillance right now. It's good to me. And we can jump a few more times. One, two, three, one, two. Yeah. A couple more times. Then we'll make our way to the exit and uh, finally get out of this first sector. It's taking a while. But um, it was an interesting offer. Let's offer our services. We're not properly equipped. You know, I think I'm properly equipped. But, I mean, I guess it's for you to decide. Need some scrap so we can actually power these things on. This man surrender if they're good. So yeah, they're going to fight. They also have really bad weaponry, and it's interesting. You know, like, a couple of runs ago, Sector 1 was really brutal in terms of how much weaponry these ships had, but I'm not proving to be that big of an issue anymore. Let's go ahead and mind control the weapons, dude. And they're still not going to send anyone to deal with it. You can see why it's a bit of an issue, but... I'm just going to let their weapons get down. Uh, we can stun their drone. I don't feel like dealing with... Oh, well, went for their anti-drone drone, but it should be no problem. We're also doing some pretty bad damage to it. Oh, we can also stun people in rooms, I just realized. Oh, they're jumping! I didn't even realize that they're gonna jump. Shoot! Oh, uh, now... Uh, I didn't even realize that. Let's go to the abandoned, set, the abandoned sector. Let's uh, show... Let's show these Lanius, who the real Lanius are. If that makes any sense. We gotta fix our oxygen. Didn't realize it was down. Don't really know how it went down. Because I have full hell. It's a bit interesting. Must have just been down for like ever and I didn't notice till now. But let's move on. So we have the intense fans edition music going. Oh, we can offer to copy or translate data suite. Okay, and we got a defense drone mark too. So we can sell that. Don't really need it. In terms of stuff and stuff. Let's fight the ship. We can go ahead and mind control their shield. Dude, and they have missiles, so... I'm gonna use a... I'm gonna use a drone part on this. To hack their weapons. Because I don't feel like dealing with this missile. Really the only reason why. then we'll try to take down their weapons. Oh, man. Didn't take down the missile. Sucks. Okay, let's get our engines up. Obviously won't dodge that. It's kind of very, very low chance, but we are managing to... We should be able to chain laser them. Oh, too slow. That's all right. Taking more damage to our weapons, but their shields are down, so... And they also have no evade, so this should be fairly simple. They'd have three bars of shield, though. Chain lasers all the way up. Should be very simple. Hacking is, uh, yeah, it's fun. These these new systems are fun to use. Really enjoy it. Because you actually see what's like, uh, fleet delayed. Sweet. So, let's get out of here. Need power, so let's go ahead and upgrade. Is there a store nearby? No. Don't think I can even afford to go to the store. Um, need power, first of all, so let's get that up. Now we can have everything on at once. Let's see, maybe... 
get our engines up and more power like that. Yeah, that seems good. Actually, even getting the third engines upgrade might be a good idea, so there we go. Looks good to me. And let's move on. Explore the rest of this uh, little cluster here. See what we can get. And uh, soon I want to get this hull laser up so we can get some intense weaponry going on. Uh, they have hacking and they also have some pretty decent weaponry, so let's go ahead and put our, uh, our hacking on. We can go ahead... Yeah, we're going to want to have to hack their weapons, I think. Or probably their piloting. That's probably a good idea. Let's do that. And I'll go ahead and mind control shield dude over here. They hacked our engines. No big deal. And let's go for the weapons. They did do, manage to do damage, but with our sick combo, we were able to uh, do a lot of damage to them. I wonder how long that one stunner ion is. I think it may be like seven, sort of like these blue things. I'm not sure if those are exactly seconds or not. Uh, it's a decent offer. No, I'm not going to accept it. I need to fix my oxygen as well. And we should kill them very quickly. Down they go. Easy peasy. Got a decent amount of scrap and didn't get any fuel, so they were offering us a lot of fuel, so it couldn't really. Uh, that was something could consider. And I guess let's save up to get our weapons up. Probably needs to get some shields up pretty soon too for the third sector. It's a good idea to have it by the third second sector. Demand center of their goods. Sounds good. They have a flak one, but they also are trying to get away, so. I'm also going to send some dudes aboard, so it's interesting. I can either have him come here or I can just mind control him there. Interesting. I think it's a better idea to mind control the pilot so they can't get away. And it's going to be interesting because this guy's going to try to like man the piloting. And uh, let's go ahead and deal with this dude in the shield room. And he should die very quickly. Poor guy. Not gonna need hacking, so I'm gonna go ahead and put more engines up. And uh, looks like their flak is coming, which is a bit, bit nerve-wracking. Let's go ahead and do their shields, and then we'll attack their weapons. Nice, we missed everything. I mean, they missed everything, not we. Still have their flak up, but not that bad of a, not that big of a deal. Um, didn't manage to get their piloting down, so I'm gonna, I am going to go for that next. Hopefully this doesn't hit. Hits our hacking, that's not the worst of deals. Let's go ahead and ion stun their shields, and then go for their piloting. Got that down. You can actually mind control pretty soon. And this flak is tearing us apart. <laughs> let's see if we can get it down now. Nice. Got the flak down. And uh, let's go ahead and mind control this dude. And now this should be. They're pretty much screwed. Don't really have a chance. Let's go ahead and uh, get our Lanius to suck on the hacking after Maria's done sucking on the engines. And yeah, they're they're screwed. One last volley, and this should be it. excellent. Yeah, so we have a lot of options with the ship to approach ships. Once given the teleport roll, we can have more options, so let's continue. Burst laser and looks like a Leto or an Artemis, so that's a pretty classic com combination there. Might want to hack it. Actually, probably really do want to hack it. Let's go ahead and mind control there. Dude right there, and let's put some hacking up in here. Yeah. and hack it, although I can't guarantee that I'll fire before the burst laser and missile fires. Oh, oh, he did manage to get the shields down, so our mind control dude Swamps is a hero. You're a hero, man. Good job. And now we can basically keep their, their stuff down. 
Okay, now they're trying to get away. That's fine. At least they don't have any weapons. And now we want to go for their piloting. They're offering us some fuel. Uh, I'm tempted. Definitely tempted to take it, but I think we can get a bit more. Hopefully they give us fuel on this, though. One fuel. It wasn't that much better. There's a store. Is there anything to sell? Defense drone. Yeah, let's go to the store. Looking pretty good. Uh, crew teleporter. So that would complete our whole thing. Weapon pre-igniter is very good, especially for chain things. Because it gets them up. It doesn't get them up to full like, chain like power, but it does get them up one level, which is usually the longest level. So Weapon pre-igniter. Can't afford it. What am I thinking? Fire suppression. Uh, not really. I think I just want to get the crew teleporter. It's kind of expensive right now. But we can make pretty good use of that. I'm going to go ahead and do it. Uh, with getting the crew teleporter this early, especially with all the other stuff we fought, is a bit expensive. There's another store. Can't go there though. But we can start. Uh, let's send it away, party. We have the cloaking. Yeah, we have the cloning bay, so I, I can't be scared of that. But uh, my thought process is we have a good boarding crew and we can start killing their ships and stuff. So let's save positions there. I'm not sure if I want to send Alanius and uh, Mantis or, or the, both Alanius. It's interesting. But we'll save it like that. I need some more. Oh, there's a quest. Let's go there. And it's an auto hacker. Whatever. It has some scary weaponry too, so. Unfortunately, can't teleport on. Let's go ahead and put you guys back to where you belong. And what do we want to use for this? Maybe use hacking? Let's go ahead and use hacking because uh, they're going to have really high evade probably. So we just want to be able to hit our first time. We damaged our weapons, you dick. Alright, well, that's okay. We can still hit both if we hack and then go for weapons. Alright, excellent. So they are going to... Ooh, nice. Good thing we had the dude on shields, huh? And let's go for shields next. Let's see if we can actually do damage. We do. Don't get their shields down. They had three bars, but that's fine. And we can hack, and then we'll get down their shields completely. And this should be very simple now. Especially since our chain's all the way upgraded. Well, all the way uh, charged or chained up. I don't even know what to call that, but we're doing fine is what I want to say. Should be easy. They even have a fire in the piloting room. They have no chance. Poor auto hacker. Current evasion. Oh, you can see the evasion when you hack the piloting room. That's really cool. Anti personnel drone can sell that. And we got graphin and we got some stuff fixed up. So that was a good amount of stuff we got here. Welcome more graphin. So we can send everyone back, and graphin can run our our engines. Looks good to me. to want to upgrade anything. Maybe get more power? Although it's probably really want to save up for these shields. So I'm going to save up and then buy stuff when we go to the next sector. Let's continue. Should be simple. Let's go ahead and use the teleporter. Maybe. Yeah, I'm going to use the teleporter. And then I'll mind control the other dude, and we'll have a pretty pretty good chance against them. So let's go ahead and teleport on, like there. And then we'll mind control. Oh, oh, we have allies, dude. 
dudes here. Alright, so we have to be careful of that because they might kill the ship while we're aboard. And let's go ahead and just wreck these people. Where's the bomb going? Goes in shield. That's not the worst of deals. some stuff and we got our hull repair let's take our guys back before uh, they shoot the ship down but we were in no danger really there especially with our cloaking bay let's go ahead and get our shields fixed and uh, yeah that works pretty well mind control and teleporting pretty powerful especially with Lanius yeah and let's get going should have jumped here actually that was silly of me oh well Can't afford shields really soon, too. Let's explore the fat asteroid field. Thankfully, nothing bad happened, but we didn't find anything. Do I want to spend the two fuels to uh, explore this this bacon right here? I mean, abandoned sectors tend to have high rewards, so I kind of want to spend this extra fuel. Uh, but we are going to be pretty low in fuel afterward. Let's go ahead and continue. And this is just an easy ship, so I'm glad I sort of did that. Let's go ahead and take teleporting off. We're not going to use that. Oh, we can use it, actually. Let's go ahead and teleport on. Um, maybe take out their piloting. Yeah, let's do that. Hopefully we can avoid as much damage as possible. Yeah, so now they can't really avoid anything. Let's go ahead and take everyone back. Fortunately, their chain laser is going to fire just as ours. I don't know why it fired quicker. That's kind of interesting. Let's send our dudes back. It'd be good to get the reconstructive teleporter augmentation here. be very good for that. Easy shit. Glad I spent this extra fuel. And nice, we got that. Let's go ahead and go to the exit now. And let's jump out of here. Next sector. Uncharted, Nebula, or Zoltan? Zoltan would be a bit problematic since we're boarding, like, focused. Yeah, let's go to the Uncharted Nebula. And uh, let's go ahead and get some shields. There we go. So we have some decent defense going now. And we can... Yeah, so we're doing doing pretty okay. Let's go ahead and use the teleporter. And we got Giles. Awesome. I love having a lot of crew. Very happy about this. And uh, we'll save positions there. Uh, if you guys haven't watched my last run on the, on the Stealth A... Did not get as much crew as this, I'll just leave it as that, and, uh, had a big crew problem towards the end. Not gonna spoil anything else. You have a bunch of people aboard. But we can just put stuff on... Teleporters, and there's a lot of people, actually. And we might be able to kill them? Yeah, yeah, I, th I think we got it, sweet. Alright, so, took a lot of damage, but we did manage to kill them. Uh, we might not be able to teleport very reliably onto the next. Oh, you need to not, not die. All good? Okay, so, might want to upgrade the cloning base so we can get more heals up and stuff. And uh, upgrade some of our minor systems. Let's use our engines. Hopefully, we can get uh, run it. Yeah, didn't want to deal with it to be honest. Auto ships and ion, ion storms and nebulas. Not very good. Not very good at all. Let's go ahead and uh, we have two drones. And wow, that's a lot of weaponry. So let's go ahead and fire everything back up. Also, still an auto drone. I think nebulas have a higher chance of of auto drones. I just think that's how it is. We can go ahead and teleport on, do some damage. Maybe go for the piloting? Yeah, I think that's that's a very good, very solid option to get rid of their evade. Basically before our first volley, so it's okay. Uh, we are going to take some missile damage, it seems. 
Hopefully it doesn't attack anything too bad. Let's go ahead and oxygen. It's not the worst. Let's go and fix it. Is there a hull breach? Doesn't look like it. Let's go for the shields and then we'll go for weapons. And let's send everyone back. Okay, so missile's been pretty obnoxious, if you ask me, but we can send everyone back. And we need to really get their weapons down because they're doing a lot of damage to us. Thankfully, it is down now, finally. And now we can go for stuff like their shields. And the chain laser should make pretty quick work of them. And uh, a good thing about the ship is that it's pretty rare for combat drone mark ones to get the quick like double shot on the ship that takes away two shields because of how big the, the shield is because of how big the ship is. That's a huge ship, no doubt about it. Let's see if we want to upgrade anything. Perhaps get more power and upgrade clone bay or something. Maybe we want to start getting these weapons up because we are going to be reaching a lot of two shield ships. So, yeah, let's go ahead and get it up. We are going to be boarding though, so that's what I'm curious about. I think we're okay. We can still we can still do some decent damage. It might have been a good idea to get the clone by the upgrade. Let's uh, prepare to chase them. And oh man. Let's go ahead and upgrade the clone bay, because I want to have my crew on tip-top shape. And of course, I'm pretty sure it gives us some extra uh, blue options. And, okay, so this is a drone mark two, and they have some a lot of anti-shield anti weaponry. Maybe I want to put them on drones instead now. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Because this thing can wreck us if it goes out of hand. They also have, it seems like, five five bars of drone, drone power, so it's doing scary amounts of damage. Did get it down. Let's see if we can get down their piloting now. And we didn't. We missed both of our chain lasers, which is unfortunate, but not the end of the world. Let's see if we can get it down now. And we did get the piloting down, so this should be pretty, uh, pretty simple from now on. There we go. Go for the weapons next. Fairly, fairly easy. Yeah, now it's just a matter of time. Six seconds after six seconds. I think it's six seconds, or maybe even less, for the chain laser at full, uh, full power. Let's see. Does it say? Not really. Some amount of scrap there. Let's go and check it. I'm just curious. Yeah, so seven seconds. Still pretty good. Also have an anti-personnel drone to sell at the nearest shop because we're not going to ever use that since we have full systems already. Usually don't buy systems that often, uh, that quickly. So it's a different, it's a different strategy. They can't do any damage to us with uh, these drones in the ion, but if the Artemis does hit our shields, they can. So this Artemis uh, is a bit scary. Thankfully, we have these Lanius to board because you've been getting so many automated ships. Uh, tempted to go to weapons, but I think it's more important to go for piloting because of the two shields, of course. Although, maybe going for shields wouldn't have been that bad of an idea either. But, let's see. Goes for shields, of course. <laughs> uh, we need you guys to fix that ASAP. Let's see if we can do any damage to their weapons. Take down the Artemis, so that's good. But we are taking some nasty damage from beams. Yes, this is this is not good. <laughs> the Artemis hitting was pretty bad. Thankfully, we can't really take any more damage left. Uh, well, can't take any more damage. Let's go ahead and charge our uh, chain laser. Go ahead and have you guys fix the hacking while we wait for teleporting to recharge. Let's get our Ion Stunner up as well. Let's actually send you aboard. Do some damage to... The shields. Shields. 
And nice, we we uh, managed to take out the Artemis temporarily. Now we should uh, be able to. We have basically have this in the back, so that's good. Let's go ahead and you got get you guys to fix the clone bay. Send you guys back. We're doing fine. Absolutely fine. We can do random stunning, which doesn't really matter. Send everyone back. A couple more volleys, and this should be the end of the ship. Which we did take a lot of damage. You saw as soon as our shields went down, we took like three beams, and one of them was one of the longer beams. Uh, it's pretty nasty. <laughs> the ship did a lot of damage. Wow. Also, still needed some fuel. So hopefully we can find some fuel or a shop. There's a shop, so I'm going to make my way there. We can fix up and get some more fuel there. Oh, man, we're not getting anything. Fortunately, just automated ships, which aren't ideal because I want to use... Ooh, pike beam. That is tempting. Another automated reloader. Sultan shield bypass. This is good. That is good. I don't think... Uh, I can sell the anti-boarding drone. I mean, anti... Well, I guess anti-personnel is anti-boarding, sort of. I love the pike beam. <laughs> It's so tempting. If we like, we could get through three shields and then do pike beam damage. If we, if we get the pike beam. Although I'm not sure if I, it's necessary because we do have the teleporting and we have really good in, uh, well, boarding capabilities. Let's, uh, let's see. Interesting. I'm, I'm really torn apart. I mean, Sultan's Shield Bypass is really good for our teleporting. Automated reloader, reloader is really good for our chain. I think this is the lowest probability of me getting... Better recharge, I don't have a backup battery, so. Uh, the people, I have a lot of people, so I'm not going to get any, although the NGs are pretty tempting. Chain Ion is, is good. But no. Pike Beam is what I'm really considering. And if I got the Pike Beam, would I sell my Hell Laser? I don't think so. I think I would keep the, keep the Pike Beam. So then we could have some, we'd have some pretty decent uh, late game weaponry. Hull laser, chain laser, pike beam, iron center. Seven bars and we can get through four shields pretty reliably. With a uh, five anti-shield sort of lasers and a volley and then the pike beam. Uh, but I do need to get a lot of fuel so this would take away 21. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna get the pike beam. Get all the fuel we can. And then we'll fix up the rest. Alright, so can't use the pike beam yet. Definitely want to upgrade weapons soon. Let's go ahead and do this. I think that's uh, appropriate, maybe? Yeah, I think that's good. So let's go to this exit. Make our way to the next beacon. And uh, really want to get some power and some weapon. Weapon weapon power, if that makes any sense. Well, hopefully we can get these extra scrap rewards from teleporting onto not automated ships anymore. Let's send the crew to help. Got our nick back, so that's no problem. Lost some weapon things, but really, it's not a big deal. Let's move on. It sort of looks like Earth. Uh, yeah, I'll take that. Drone parts are good. Still need more fuel, though. Even after getting a 7 fuel, which is a lot to get from a shop, no doubt about it. Um, let's see. They insist...
we have a virus so I can use hacking or we can use our lanius crew I'm gonna go ahead and use hacking it takes time the virus is slippery but you eventually can find it easily slips in prison blah blah blah, blah. you check this blah blah and we get a drone reactor booster so that is something we can sell um, probably should just sell it right now come to think of it even though I can't really buy anything at the shop let's see what's here curious uh, backup batteries okay and yeah no don't think I need missiles for this run I do want to get more fuel though and uh, probably let's go ahead and just sell this now no need for it fix up maybe we are in an entry an entry sector so we have some pretty good chances of finding events that uh, repair a hull so I'm not gonna go ahead and do that just yet uh, looks like they sent some dudes over so let's go ahead and two shields so I'm gonna wanna it's gonna be interesting who are they gonna send aboard let's let them keep their dude aboard and we'll have a okay so yeah I'm gonna mind control and do some fancy tactics here Do that and then we'll mind control the mantis like that and we'll send our engines dude and our mantis over here to deal with the shield person actually we don't need doors really to be manned so we can send three people and they only have a charge laser so they can't really do damage unless they hit our shields with their small bomb and uh, we can get their cloning bite down which is good and they're ioning, what is that, oxygen? That's fine. Let's ion stunner their stuff. Hopefully we can chain laser their shields. And nice, we hit everything, so the shields are down by one. Let's go to their weapons now. They do have upgraded doors, which is a bit obnoxious. We can send more people, actually, so I'm tempted to do that. Let's go ahead and put you on surveillance. See what's there. Yeah, let's just go ahead and do that. Should be able to handle the rest of them really easy. Wasn't very necessary, but have been quicker. Iron Charger, so I'm glad I didn't buy that. Uh, probably just gonna end up selling it. I'm not sure if I want that over the uh, the Ion Stunner charge ion over the ion stunner because it takes more power it ion stunner mm, charge ion's pretty good might actually keep this over the hull smasher laser because effectively this is just going to be getting through shields and this will get two ions quicker Maybe not. I know we'll have to see what we find at the next shop. Do I want to upgrade anything? Probably get weapons. It's uh, very important. Yeah, let's get weapons so we can get our pike beam up. And let's move on. Let's go ahead and repair five damage. It's cheap. And we need exactly five, so that was perfect. Still need more fuel. Getting kind of scared. It's basically the same ship. Except, yeah, it's basically the same ship, except this is a more powerful laser that fires. A bit slower, though. Uh, let's go ahead and teleport on. Wait, after their dude deports. And then we'll go ahead and mind control their mantis. Send my mantis aboard. Well, send my mantis to uh, deal with that. And maybe I want to get the pike beam going. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Pike beam, let's get going. And 
And there goes their their NG, so that's pretty simple. Let's go ahead and chain ion. Or we'll, we'll chain laser and then we'll pike beam. Let's go ahead and just pike beam their They have a door system, but it's not up for some reason. That's interesting. Maybe he's in there damaging it? I don't know. Let's go ahead and take out the rest of this dude. Yeah, we have a really good boarding system up. Very happy about it. And uh, this guy's running away from us for random reasons. We got another whole smasher laser. Wow, this is a lot of weaponry. Uh, really want to find a store to sell all this stuff. Only have a few jumps before the next exit. Uh, really need fuel as well. Let's participate in the study. Gave us some scrap, thanks. No store, unfortunately. It looks like we have only one jump before the exit, so let's make that one jump, and then we'll go to the exit. Really need fuel. Please give me some option to buy like six fuel for cheap. Let's intervene. I need fuel. Here's some hacking. They have a missile. The ion's not scary. It doesn't matter, really. Let's send our people aboard to take out their piloting. They're hacking our shields. Still not that big of a deal. Take damage to our hacking. That's less than ideal. Uh, let's go ahead and get our engines due to fix it up. No, we need you on engines. Let's see if we can wait till their piloting's down and then we'll go ahead and chain, uh, chain laser. Then we'll pike beam. I don't care if one of my crew gets hurt. It's, it's uh, for more important purposes. Send our crew back. If you guys fix the oxygen, that's very important. Ship's doing a bit of damage to us. their weapons are still not down. Really need to get oxygen up. I don't know why our oxygen isn't up. Very curious. Thankfully we do have the emergency respirator so it's not that scary of a deal. Uh, and we should be able to kill in the next volley really. Oh, and I should have went for the weapons. I'm an idiot. I guess it's not the, the end of the world. Let's go ahead and finish them off with a pike beam and down they go. So whole ship was out of oxygen. Still no fuel. One fuel. Not good. I mean, I appreciate the double reward, but need some fuel, bro. Can't get our weapons up, at least. We have so many weapons. Jeez, look at this. Let's definitely sell one of these helmet lasers. Maybe even both. And let's send everyone back. Go to the next sector. Let's see, Rock or Mantis? Rock has to 10 more missiles. Oh, well, tends to have more missiles. Yeah, let's go for the Mantis. Hopefully, we can get more fuel. There's a store, so I'm definitely gonna go there. Sell some weaponry, maybe buy some stuff, heal up a bit. And uh, let's see. Distraction boys. <laughs> Stealth weapons, nah. These are crappy weapons. Definitely gonna sell these though. Let's see, do I wanna use the charge ion over the hull laser? Well, this takes less time to charge two shots, but it only takes away one bar of shield at once, so. I guess the hull laser is better for taking out shields. Although with the ion center and the charge ion, the ion damage will stack, so we'll eventually get all the shields down by just using that. Yeah, let's do that. I can get more money off the hull laser too. 
So let's sell the Hull Laser. I'm gonna try going for Ion Beam and, and Auxiliary Chain Laser setup going, and uh, let's definitely buy all this fuel. Still not nearly enough. And let's maybe fix everything. There's another store, so let's go to that store first and see what's there. Anti-bio. It's interesting. Not really necessary. Let's get more fuel though. And uh, perhaps fix the rest. Then we need to focus on our weapons, of course. Yeah, let's do that. Upgrade weapons once. Get a bar right there. So we can get the chain, the pike, and the ion stunner. So we can get through three shields now. We have a good amount of drone parts, so if we need to use it on the piloting so we can get our volleys to hit, we should be a-okay. We have a few people aboard. Let's go ahead and uh, have our dudes deal with that. And also get the doors up so we can not have them escape. And they're going to die really quickly. No chance. Awesome. Let's get out of here before something comes. Let's move on. Gonna get another uh, power bar of power, power bar, <laughs> power bar. Anyways, uh, okay. So burst laser three. I feel like we can get it down before we have to deal with it. I'm gonna send two mantis aboard. It's a bit problematic, I guess, but we can just teleport aboard. Their ship. They don't have. They do have a cloning bay. Let's do that. Who do what we want to? Mind control. The Mantis dude, of course. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's see where they teleport on. Looks like they're going to do damage to our surveillance before they get out, maybe? Yeah, they did just in time. Let's get them out of here. Hopefully they don't damage the door system. Ooh. We're going to take some damage here. Forgot to use my weapons. I was I I was focusing too much on these mantis, which aren't that big of a deal. Let's use the ion stunner. And chain laser, and then uh, we will do something like this. Do a lot of damage there. Didn't take that much damage from the burst laser, surprisingly, and they did get down our doors, which is now kind of a bad thing because we're like doing this stuff. Maybe we send our Lanius back. Wait, where are they at? Deal with that. They're gonna do damage to us. I guess that's fine. Let's go and fix doors. Where is this person? We are taking a lot of damage. Don't appreciate that. Okay, so let's get our oxygen up. That was really bad technique on my part, but that's okay, I guess. Let's have you guys fix this. 
Have you guys fix that? We need to get the oxygen up. Let's fix the surveillance and get everything back up and running. Send everyone back. We're all pretty hurt, but that's okay. We did manage to do that. We did take a lot of damage, though. Let's see, go to the stress beacon, maybe? Man, that's a long distance uh, jump. It's kind of surprising that we can do that. Not going to go there. I still need more fuel, even though we had two shops and bought all the fuel we can. Actually, three shops, if you look in the grand, uh, grand scheme of things. But let's see what we can find. I uh, probably want to get more power, actually. Should have before this. Uh, Should have got it before this fight. There's a lot of missiles here. I'm not appreciating that. Uh, so I might want to hack. Yeah, definitely need more power. And let's get you here on doors. Let's see where they end up coming. Let's teleport aboard. Take out their cloning bay because they have it. And then we'll get their mantis, dude. Don't dodge anything. I guess it's expected, really. Let's iron stun their shields and then chain their shields and then pike beam. Take out some of their weapons. And people. No, it was too late. Was, I mean, too early. That was silly of me. Let's see if we can get. Dodge this missile. We don't dodge anything, of course. Thankfully, they're taking some pretty bad damage. There's a hull breach. These missiles are doing some nasty work to us. And we gotta get you guys to do stuff. What are you what are you doing? Do we dodge? Oh we dodge a missile finally. Don't fire the pipe beam too early. We're gonna take some damage from a missile, probably. You can pike beam to death. The guy dies. Okay, finally, and they did fire right before though. Did get another weapon though, so let's go ahead and get everyone back. And jump. Just before that missile hits. Awesome. <sighs> Alright, so we can doors it up. There's a lot of people. Is this going to be four mantis? Gee. Okay. Well. Alright then. Can mind control one of them. Let's do the people in the clone bay because those are really problematic. Losing my people, but that's alright. And they all die. Easy peasy. Could have been really bad had we not had the clone bay. Really. Really bad. Send everyone back. We need to get our oxygen up, of course. 
And uh, let's upgrade our power, like I've been saying I've been do would do. So we can get. Still, probably getting another power bar is a good idea. Let's do it. There we go. We can send everyone back. Probably should fix this hull breach. Let's go ahead and get you guys to do that real quick. With some Ilanius, I know, but I'm sorry. I just lazy to wait this long. It's been a long run because of all of the big decisions I've been having to do. Let's see. It's going to be about one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's go ahead and do it. Really need fuel still. They have a med bay. That's obnoxious. Maybe I'm going to hack it. Let's go ahead and put you on doors as well. I'm going to send these people over. I have my Lanius deal with that. Like that. And then we'll hack soon. They have a lot of lasers. That's kind of scary. Okay, let's see. Let's send them. Send them to the piloting. Then we'll mind control the mantis in here. Nice. And we'll also hack the med bay. Or we can just damage it, probably, actually. Like that. So we're doing fine. Can we end up killing him? No. Ugh, oh, fine. You guys can die, I don't care. Do that. Send their landies over to finish this guy off. Awesome. So we got um alright stuff. We're still really in need of fuel. I mean I haven't been like super desperate where I'd have to wait or anything, but not haven't been comfortable in a long, long few jumps. <laughs> They're trying to get away, and they have cloaking, and they have really scary weaponry. Okay, so let's see. Forget if you can lose your crew if the ship jumps away with your crew on it. And they have three shields. Whoa. Okay, so this is gonna be problematic because they're going to send these two missiles immediately. I'm not going to need mind control, but I am going to need hacking, probably. Thankfully the halberd doesn't hit before like an ion. Okay, so. Let's send our dudes to the piloting, and then I'll hack their shields. Or maybe they're cloaking. Or weapons. Maybe getting the weapons is the best idea. Yeah, let's do that. And our hacking <laughs> is stopped in its track, so that's not a not that great. Let's get you guys, let's get you to fix this. Oh jeez, it's gonna... I think we got their piloting down. Let's actually go for their... Hmm. 
Going for the weapons or the shields? I'm not sure. Let's go for the weapons. A lot of damage there. Now we can't get through their, th their shields, so that's obnoxious. To say the least. Dodge the ion, though. Thank God we did that. It's not like I would, I would appreciate dodging anything else. Uh. Oh, got both their missiles down. I'm surprised. I guess those are higher priority. Let's go ahead and uh, put you fixing some stuff. Actually, don't need our evade anymore, so. Let's go and fix everything up. Nice. Inner hacking's on finally. Although, it's not really necessary. Do that. We can hit everything. Nice. Who's almost hurt? That's fine. Send it right back. I mean, we could actually kill that. Uh, no, I'm not gonna do that. And let's send our dudes back before we lose them. There we go. I mean, it wouldn't have been the end of the world because we would have gotten back from the cloning bay, but... Thankfully the ship didn't jump away. That was pretty close, actually. Make our last jump to the exit. <laughs> Sorry about that. Wow. Let's start with the fugitive. Five damage short hull. Okay, so we need to find some fuel and now a lot of um, a lot of repairing abilities. Unfortunately, they did damage to our teleporting, but we will get that up really quickly. They have three shields, um, and they also have a defense drone, which I'm not fond of because we can't use our uh, hacking on that. So, big of a, a bit of a bummer. Can't get through the three shields, but I want to use the hack and get uh, through reliably, and. Uh, they can get through our two shields and then do a lot of beam damage, which is very scary. So let's send our dudes... Yeah, let's send them to the weapons, I guess. And we'll mind control their mantis, definitely. They have a lot of mantis aboard. Thankfully the beam isn't going to hit now. Let's see. Let's see if we can get, get through to them. And of course it hits the defense drone, which I guess isn't that bad. fixing stuff like now come on get these weapons down let's go this is scary we need to fix our teleporting in case I want to jump out of here okay so you're stunned of course the weapons are finally getting down. They have. I know the rest of their crew is really low on uh, health. So good there. The weapons are finally down. They had a lot of bars. It was two, four, five, six, maybe. Go ahead and mind control their highest person. Let's see, you're at seven. You're nine. Let's go ahead and do that. Looks like my mind control sniped them. Nice. Can we attack them? 
No, we have to wait for the mind control to wear off. Okay, so uh, two hold is not a lot of hold. Oh, don't kill my dude, you jerk. We got Zemu. Okay. <laughs> two hull. We have seven people. Think of all the poor people that will die if we lose this shit. <sighs> okay, I'm pretty sure we're right near an exit too, so hopefully we can find a shop in our like first jumps. So where's this guy going to go? I guess we'll put you on doors. Probably need someone on shields, actually. That's probably something I should do. Now that I think about it. Is there going to be a store at this exit? Let's leave them be. I'm not going to take random hull damage. Here's another abandoned sector, so this can be bad. Continue. Please just shop. No, there's a distress beacon. I'm going to avoid it. Maybe I should upgrade. Hacking. I feel like that might be a good idea. Let's go ahead and do that. And I'm going to get the surveillance up, so we don't need to have someone on that. And uh, we can put our Mantis dude on shields. There we go. Let's move on. Hopefully we can find a store in this, the next beacons. Really scared. Let's offer to copy, translator, sure. Drone recovery arm. Wow, a lot of drone augments. Okay, well. <sighs> okay, well, I'm really stressed. I'm actually going to cut the the run into here it's been going for a while so we're <laughs> we're doing all right it's just i need some repair as soon as possible but man i'm scared anyway if you guys like the video go ahead and like it if you guys have any suggestions for my runs go ahead and suggest them if you guys have a suggestion for my new let's play series a game go ahead and suggest that in the comments as well if you guys want to see more let's play ftl advanced edition just go ahead and subscribe because i submit a bunch of those and i'm going to be having that new series as well so <sighs> okay i'm the modern shoe thanks for watching guys and i'll see you guys in the next episode let's see if i can actually get through this <laughs>